fish to tell you. I got a fish. Hello everyone, this is August 27th, 2021. My wife Lily and I came to Alaska for a one week vacation and we planned for a deep sea fishing trip in Seward to end our memorable Alaska trip. I've done deep sea fishing in California for over a dozen times this year, but it's been a while since Lily went on a trip like this. So I hope we both have a great time, but more importantly, I want my wife to have a memorable trip. Target species for this trip are halibut and rockfish. I didn't bring my slow pitch setup here, but I did but I did bring a few slow pitch jigs to Alaska with me, hoping to do some bottom jigging for rockfish, if not halibut. About 30 minutes into fishing, I saw that my rod tip was bending. I quickly cranked into the reel, and it turned out to be our first halibut. I got a fish. I got a fish. Yeah, that's a nice one. Now that is the first halibut I've ever caught in my life. It's a 20 pound fish, but it's pretty solid. And now it's Liddy's turn to get her first ever halibut. Should we stop? That's good, that's good, that's good. I borrowed the rod from the boat to try and do some jigging while we wait for the halibut to bite the bait. But as you can tell, it's pretty painful to try to work a jig using a halibut rod. But we still managed to catch a few rockfish. Right 
So here I hooked my second halibut, but since I already got one, we decided to let Diane, uh, our friend, to take the opportunity to get her first halibut. <laughs> So this has been one of my favorite slow pitch jig uh, recently. It's the Johnny Flatty. Uh, it worked really well in California water, and that's why I decided to bring it here to California. I'm sorry, to Alaska, and try it out to see how it works over here. After catching about 10 halibut uh, for the first six hours, the captain decided to make a move and come here to the rock fishing ground to hopefully get everyone the limit on rockfish. And uh, in this case, uh, actually, I switched to a lighter rod and reel, uh, but still, it's not ideal for slow pitch jigging because first, the rod is uh, again too stiff, and secondly, they're using mono on the reel um, instead of uh, braid, so it's really difficult to feel the bite of the fish. Um, but you know, we make do with what we have. I cannot complain. We're still catching fish with the slow pitch jig, regardless of the situation. Oh, what's that? Oh, okay. You're fishing a little bit. So, how many cranks are on the bottom? Here, Lily hooked something. It's pretty significant and looks larger than a rockfish, uh, which turned out to be a halibut, which is surprising to everyone on the boat because we are not expected to catch halibut in this spot, which is uh, fantastic for us. It's fantastic for Lily. It's her second halibut of the day, and she was the only one on the boat who caught two halibut. And she had a great, fantastic time. Nice! <laughs> so cool! Very small. Not sure. Nice. Oh, nice. Target species of fire.
你在底部也可以继续。At the end of the day, both my wife and I, we had a great time on this trip and I think we brought home about 23 pounds of fish in total, um, about um, 17, 15 pounds of halibut plus about 7 pounds of uh, rockfish, which was uh, very delicious. And thanks for watching again everyone. If you liked the video, please click the like button and I'll see you next time.